Hello everyone, Rissy Toothpick here, back again with some more Medieval Dynasty. The last time we kind of stole some things from the town, we began to put a little crops on the ground. Hopefully that's all we need to do, I'm not for sure, we might have to water it. If so, then that crop's going to die. Um, I've learned in between episodes that, um... You know, the cauldron is for your fancy food, but down below, we can just cook our regular meat here. And we probably want to craft all of them. Oh, look at that, using a stick as well. Is that a spear? Can we uh, take that spear by any chance? I think we ran out of spears last time, so we need to get more. Because we're going to want at least like four or five, so we need to get our axe out. And, uh, yeah, start working on some more trees here. You might as well get these up here. We need a nice pathway for people to walk down the trail. And... Apparently... There should be feathers nearby. Don't know where, though. But, yeah, apparently there's supposed to be feathers dropping by like all the trees when you cut them down right there and we're gonna need the feathers so when we get the bow which might take forever but once we do get it we'll be able to craft arrows and we want all four of those because we've learned that uh to put down deer and wildlife you need a lot more than just one or two that bison still remembers me. But I think what we're going to do is we're going to cut down one more tree. We'll have, I guess, I'm assuming eight spears, and then we'll be good to go. And I think what we should do, we might as well go do the mission. So we're going to lock new things and pretty much figure out the game a little bit more. Oh. And then also, we probably need to figure out what season we're in. I'm assuming it's like a fall or spring. Oh, we're overweight. Let's go in here, craft, wooden spears, all four. Or at least we're getting there. See, what happens when we make spears? It definitely lowers our burden. Perfect, can we run? We can't really run. But here, let's go in here. Let's go to our inventory. Wooden spears, we want to equip you at three. And our wooden hammer, you equipped at one. There we go. In here, what do we have that's burdening us? Maybe it is the spears. Well, I mean, there's one by itself, so you know what? We'll just hold on to seven. The rye, yeah, definitely the 71 rye. Just throw that over there for now. We don't need it. Oh, actually, hold on. It's it's not red no more. It's not red anymore? Oh, no. It's still red. For a minute there, I thought we kind of cheesed the game. We don't need the leather. Fur. And we don't need feathers at the moment. Rocks and sticks we'll hold on to. Everything else can go. Now, the mission is way over there, so our job is to probably look for, ooh, St. John's Wort. I don't know what that's for, but we're going to get it. We look at our map here. It's spring. In the summertime, we can pick berries and we can make a whole bunch of money, and that's probably what we're going to be doing when the season ends. So expect that in the near future, because apparently you can sell... Oh, that's why. But anyways, you can sell berries in the summer for like a gold and you can get a whole bunch of them, apparently. So that's going to be our goal. I mean, we might as well also check out this village as well. And let me make sure we still got to look for some health items. It's a lot of St. John's work, though, just like showing up out of the blue. Rocks, we'll pick up some rocks as well. 
don't think that's good enough for rocks at the moment. Ooh, 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 broadleaf plantain. Okay, so broadleaf plantain have like a brownish hue to them. So now we know what we're looking for. And I keep my eye out here now. Maple branches, we don't care about that. Ooh, hold on, there's a broadleaf plantain. Nearly like walked right over it. What's that? That is something we can't pick. Just trying to keep my eye out here for more. All right, and with that taken care of, we go to our food resources, eat it. There we go, we got full health again. It took us so long. I have also learned that the side missions are seasonal. So once the season changes, then the side mission is I guess like failed or not completed. What does a person body mean? I wonder. Is he a traitor maybe? Hello stranger, I come to this line recently and I don't know anyone here. What can I do for you? Oh, so we can make this guy join our uh, our little village that we're growing. We're kind of poor at the moment. I don't think we can afford it. But that would definitely be, well, you know what? We might need someone. He might be able to farm and stuff. Let's talk to him. Yeah, I'm creating a new settlement. I'm looking for good people willing to join me. I've heard you're building your reputation up. Keep going, I might consider your position. And we need some reputation. Residents of your village, to encourage people into joining your village, you need to reach the right amount of dynasty reputation points. You can try to convince them by building houses for them and talking to free people in the area who may like to join your growing settlement. People are much needed to help collect resources faster, look after the animals, cultivate fields, develop technology, and improve everyone's quality of life. So yeah, definitely cultivating fields is what I want. I want somebody to go out there and work my carrots pretty much <laughs> we, we're in need of the money all right so while we're out here we're going to keep on looking for that broadleaf plantain it's a little bit harder because you kind of kind of go a little slow just to kind of see it out of all the growth but like i've said earlier you can also lower down the foliage and that would make it a lot easier except it look a little bit rougher because, you know, you'll have, like, plains, <laughs> just grass, maybe a few trees. I wonder what that is. That's just a path, I remember. All right, let's see. I think we're good. I think it's getting dark, though. It's the only problem. So we kind of chose the wrong time to go do this mission. But you know what? So we're, you know what? we're just going to run. We're going to try to avoid bison. Because we know what happened last time we did that. He smacked me to oblivion. There he is. Look at him go. I don't know how close you have to be for him to get aggressive, but don't want to find out. I think you have to like run like literally into him. But we're close now. For being 600 meters away, once you start running, you really, you know, catch up. We'll pick up some mushrooms along the way for food. It's like an easy food source here. And then when winter comes around, we really get to push out the uh, rabbit traps. Ooh, that's a wolf. I don't want to fight the wolf. I don't have to. So let's follow the trail. Oh, there's another one. God damn it. Yeah, I got my spear. Here he comes. Oh, god damn. Hit him. Hit him. Broke a spear. Our health. Got him. Oh my god, our health is so low. Alright, well, you know what? We killed him. We gotta skin him. Don't you get wolf, you little bastard? So many, there's like so much wildlife out here and you chose me? What is that? Oh, it's all the blood. Oh, there's another wolf over there. Okay, yep. Definitely run. We found the cabin. Yeah, don't mess around with wolves. They'll, they'll tear you up. Hey, he, we can actually just pick up these stone axes. 
Apparently we can pick up these stone knives as well. I mean, they're not a theft, so we're not going to worry about it. Let's talk to him. He's not interested in talking to you right now. Are you kidding me? Is it because it's dark out? Oh, this bastard. Oh, we can definitely rob him, but he ain't got nothing to rob. Alright. Can we sleep by any chance by this fire, or do we need to craft a fire? Let's see here. Other... Simple fire, I think. If you make, like, a simple fly fire, you can sleep by it, but you won't get no uh, health regen. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay, here we go. Light the fire. And sleep. Perfect. And that will be available here pretty soon. We can also cook the... I guess the tap to cook. We can cook that meat. Kind of preserve it a little bit longer. But yeah, I'm just glad we were able to successfully kill the wolf. Alright, how much time left? There we go. And then that is gone. Perfect. Let us go talk to this guy now. Hopefully we're in the good here. He's definitely moving a lot more. I guess we're supposed to meet him maybe outside of his uh, cabin? Yep, we're just gonna follow him. There's some mud here, probably clay. Yeah, shovel required. Good to know where we can find some clay, that's for sure. This guy's literally just gonna walk around these deer, huh? Look at him, they're like, ah, nothing's going on. There's nothing wrong here. Oh, he's got a bow. Bruh, talk to me here. Maybe it was me picking up them axes, even though they weren't like a uh, steel. They were, and we just like messed up. With that being the case, then let's kind of look around for the the broadleaf. We can also eat some food here as well. Let's see, roasted meat, nutrition of a six, so it's better than actually dried meat. Oh. Not the one I wanted. Ooh, reduces the level of poisoning. Good to know. Let's eat these mushrooms. And then we can just drink some water at the... The lake. This guy's... Oh, come on, man. Talk to me. You know what? Screw it. We're gonna go to this river. Or this, like, little... Patch of water. Drink it. Alright, let me look for more brow leaf. Nope, now he's just standing there. You are dirty. Come on. Surviving character parameters. Okay, so what happens when we're dirty? We need to build a wash tub. In others. So we just need two logs for that. Okay, that's not terrible. I really want to talk to this guy. <laughs> like, what is your deal, bruh? Let me see here. Talk to Samber. Survive for a season, yeah. Here, we'll track this quest then. And then he's gone, and then let us go back to our journal and track it again. Dude, I think we might need to kill this guy. <laughs> like, just put him down. He's a bastard. Like, ran out here, fought a wolf, nearly died. And he's like, oh, I don't want to talk to you, I'm better than you. It might have been the axes, I'm not gonna lie. 
I feel like even though they weren't theft, he's still pissed off about it. Of course, he didn't really like communicate, talk, or do anything. Oh shit. We're probably dead. Which might be. Nope, nope. We killed him. Man, that scared me. I was not expecting that boar just to come charging at us there. Definitely more aggressive than they usually are. There's another one. I really don't want to fight y'all. I'm out here trying to get some health, really. Alrighty, well, you know what? He's a problem. Only thing I can say we do is go to Fort Alwyn's quest. Which is kind of a pain because we went <laughs> one way to the other. Like, we went 600 meters one way. Just to go completely back. That's how the cookie crumbles, though, apparently. Alright. Looking for some plant life here. Come on, broadleaf plantains. They're, like, hidden in here. Sure, we'll pick that up for a poison. Climb the mountain. There's a little pathway we can take. I'm assuming it's kind of like a safer route. And we'll probably go across the river too. And you just go straight towards it. Question, do we have more plantain on us or do we use it all? We use it all. How unfortunate. Okay, here we go. At least we have some like a uh, little bit of field here. We can kind of look for it. There's a lot of St. John's word out here, though. Like, you don't have to worry about poisoning, apparently. Just, you know, bulk up on that. And you're good to go. Probably only in the spring. If you do it any other season, it probably won't be here. Okay, so. Don't really notice it. But I did notice a lot of it. Oh, there's one there. Okay, so we found one. There's usually more around. Yeah, they kind of have them like grouped up together. So once you find one, one of the plants you're looking for, just look around and then you're going to find like 10 more apparently. We definitely need to get a lot of these though. Let's eat them, get our health back up. 95 is good enough. Here we go. Made it back to that one village. Oh, they do got chickens. I really want to get her some uh, settlers and then some chickens, maybe some cows to kind of help us out. Come on, man. You got to you gotta wash yourself here. I don't really know what happens if we, you know, stay dirty. We might get like a disease. So to prevent that, I think what we need to go is to our house and then uh, make that wash basin. Of course, before we go there, we'll go straight towards the river here and see if that will get rid of the dirtiness. It does. So just running into the water will remove dirtiness. Which is good to know. Oh, there you go. You can actually look. Is there fish? I say that'd be pretty cool. Just spear, spear fishing. Name with oh, spear broke. <laughs> so apparently, uh, spears go by each um, time you like throw it out there. Probably not each time you hit something. So good to know. Back home, we're going to put the plantains away. Kind of start like holding them, hoarding them, so we have them later. A little bit of meat. Let's cook it. No, 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 no. We'll cook all of it. And then we're going to go talk to Alwyn's. And hopefully once we do his mission, maybe sleep for the night. And when we head back over there... 
maybe we'll get the mission. That's my hope. If not, I might have a bug or something's wrong or I did something very inappropriate where he's like, I'm not talking to you, bastard. But anyways, there's some more people here, these two women. I want to tell you something, beautiful lady. Oh. I've heard you're building your reputation up. Keep going, yeah, so we just need reputation, really. A wife is necessary to ensure the survival of your dynasty. Thanks to her, you will have an heir who, after reaching the right age, will continue your history, improve dynasty reputation, and develop the village. Your wife can also help you rethink your talent and heal your wounds. Remember to take care not only of yourself, but also of your whole family. If your wife is very dissatisfied with your action, lack of shelter for a long time, food, or the possibility of warming up in winter, she may leave you and take the air with you. Oh. We're gonna have to get an air here. Have to do a little bit of work in the bedroom, get ourselves a, a little child like Oga. Oga looks a little rough. He's got like a man's face as like a toddler. He's a grown ass man. Look at him. Here's an axe, man. Go work on the trees. Let's talk to Alwyn. He approves of us. I'm tired of my mother's conflict with Chiragnuva. Her son, Delbor, won't leave my little sister Oga alone. I understand that it's just a game for him, after all. When I was in his age, I played with Dorbamira, his older sister. I was a knight with a stick instead of a sword, but I defended her honor. Like every knight does, it's adorable. Anyway, you are a fool. I think he needs something to keep him busy and stay away from my sister. So that you can have some peace too, huh? It would be nice. Deliver to Delivore stick. <laughs> so we gotta get a whole bunch of sticks apparently. 40 of them. I guess the kid's gonna get like distracted by all the sticks, be like, oh. What are these for? Let's get in here. Damn Delivore, you're old as hell. Why are you playing with like a little toddler for? Ah, uh, you're Delivore, right? You look very strong for your age. Have you ever thought of becoming a knight? It's my dream. Are you a knight? No, but I know a lot about them. Have you heard that all of them start learning how to fight with a wooden sword already at your age? Where could I get a, such a sword, not a knight? It just so happens that I have one with me, and I can give it to you because you're clearly worthy. I'm honored. It may look inconspicuous, but it is certainly an excellent practice weapon for an aspiring knight like you. Give a stick. It looks a bit like a regular stick. To surprise your opponent. And do you know what else knights do besides fighting battles? They ride horses? This is well, but most of all, they protect the ladies and children from danger and make sure no harm is done to them. Really? Sounds like a lot of work. Yes, this is the most important principle of chivalry. Alright, thank you for the sword, not a knight. Now I'm going to defend the ladies and the children. You're welcome, young master. You're welcome. There we go. Let's go talk to Alwyn. We dealt with the nuisance. Hi, I solved your problem with Delbar. Yes, I saw him running around the village with a stick. You must have an amazing gift of persuasion. The young ones do not listen to anyone. You gave me the idea with the stick in the night story. I got this bread from... Dobromira as an apology for her brother's behavior, but I think you've earned it. Here, take it. Thank you. No problem. Sometimes she gives me things from her mother's tavern. Are you close? No, I do not know. Wait for the next summer for him. Okay. Now if we look at our inventory. How is our food? We definitely have some uh, decent amount of food. I think what we need to do is we need to sell some to kind of start building up our gold. Show me your wares. So we go here at our food items. Price is two. Three for dried meat, but we'll sell our meat. We'll sell like three of them. Kind of start working on that. We don't have no money. The flatbed can go. Oat rolls, 
that as well. We'll hold on to the apples because of thirst. Leather? Yeah, sure, have it. We have some there at the home and the fur. We can always uh, kill more animals. Okay, with that taken care of, we need to probably look at our technology. Technology goes up by us doing things, so... Probably need to hunt more. Food storage has been unlocked. Probably due to us farming and making that like plot of land. So if we go here to crafting, nope, never mind. Buildings, farming. Looks like we need a little bit more for the barn. What about storage? We do have one here. Food storage one. We just need some logs for it. The village main storage for food. It receives food collected in the hunting lodge, fishing hut, barn, and animal buildings. Inhabitants need this building to get food. So with that taken care of, I think we can uh, come back to our little home here and start building some things to improve our life. One thing we're going to need is probably that water basin for cleaning. We're just going to come over here and cut down this tree. Oh, I got tired. There we go. Hopefully we don't get killed by uh, fallen trees. That would be terrible. Alright, pick out them logs. Of course, we're over encumbered. We go here crafting. It's probably other wash tub. Can't put it in there, unfortunately. Put it right here, but I don't really want to. I want to put it close to our house here. There we go, and we can take a bath. Oh yeah, look at that, that bath animation. Washing the hands a little bit. You gonna spit it out? Oh, no. Usually what they do with the wash basin is they would like use it to clean themselves, but because they weren't really, how do I say this? Like they would pretty much snot in their water and like pass it around or they could, you know, like they weren't very, it wasn't good if you shared wash basins, I guess. And of course, you know, diseases and stuff like that were an issue. But anyways, let's go in here. We need to remove some things on our body. Keep that. The logs have to go. That's what's, you know, causing problems here. The sticks, we don't need 40. <laughs> like, that's a big no-no. Rocks, we probably only need a little bit. We should be good now. With that taken care of, let us build that storage we wanted. Okay, so we need to go cut down some logs. I think that's the only problem with our building location is uh, I cut all the trees down nearby, so now we have to move a little bit to get more wood. It is what it is, but once we start building up around here, we have what I'm hoping is enough room for a pretty large settlement. We should be good. I'll say pick it all up. I think we need to cut down one more tree. And that should be enough. Stone axe broke, but we have another one. I'm glad we took him from that uh, hunter's uh, area. Oh, come on now. Okay, you're carrying too much, I know that, but it is what you gotta do. Oh man, our guy's like barely getting there. You know, since that's the case, we might as well build it over here. We don't need it close to our house, you know? Kinda don't want it that high though. Might have to be, huh? Sure, well, let's see what happens here. Can you get up? Yes, you can, that's fine. That's the only problem I've had is uh, some places, even though you have the 
the walkway, you can get up it without jumping. We need straw. Lots of logs. Which is fine, we'll start building it. And it's already been 30 minutes, so I think we're going to be stopping here for today. So make sure to like, comment, subscribe. In the next one, I think I'm going to have this built for us. So we don't have to watch me slowly but surely get everything in it. And then we'll go on from there, hopefully being able to do that mission over there.